Hey there, Virgo. Welcome to your reading for the week of June 22nd. So thank you for joining it, joining me. Uh, you have an interesting week ahead, but first, uh, a lot of people in the channel have been asking me about my readings. Yes, I do have readings. R link is below in the description, so you can check that out there. But let's get to your reading. Um, interesting week. You have the Ace of Diamonds coming up first, which is the best financial card that you can possibly get. Minus maybe the Ace of Clubs for the most part, but it's still a very positive card. It represents changes. I think you're going through a lot of changes this week. I think it's like change, you know, one, well, maybe I think it's probably one major change. Um, but this is a change for the better. It's a change for more money, always an increase pretty much and at the very least just stability like a week where you just don't have to worry about money or anything else in your life well, just kind of like very stable type of energy to it um but usually like you said it's always like more money like a raise or uh, you know better position just more money coming in plain and simple uh, a big check showing up things like that all good stuff uh so you really can't beat this card Next, you have the Ace of Spades, which, you know, this is another card of change. Aces, the, all the aces pretty much mean change. And I always equate this card to the Death card and the Tarot. It just simply means that you're going to be, you know, leaving something behind. Maybe something that you were working on or, you know, something along those lines. And, you know, maybe a project or maybe something you thought was going to turn out a certain way, uh, like a situation. And it, and it didn't, but you're going to leave it behind. I don't feel you being too upset about it at all. Like, I think you're, like, kind of happy to leave it behind. Now that I'm saying that, I feel like it, maybe I said this to you last week. Maybe you had a similar message. I'm not exactly sure. I, don't, I didn't go back and watch the videos this week. But, um, like I said, I feel like it's something you're leaving behind. It has no effect on your life, really. And uh, you're not upset about it. Next, you have the Three of Spades. Did I say clubs on this? I don't know if I said this is an ace of clubs. I mean, ace of spades. I feel like I said clubs on that. But um, anyway, three of spades here. Uh, and, you know, if you can't tell, by the way, I've been doing videos all day. So that's why I'm uh, just jumbling all my meanings here. But all my uh, the cards. Three of spades is, um, again, leaving something behind. Very similar to this. It could even be a breakup or relationship. But like I said, it's not like you'd be upset about it. It's kind of like run its course and you're and you're done with it but this can also just be leaving a person or um you know like in a business sense like a business relationship a job relationship something along those lines uh or it can even just be leaving just something behind that's pretty much it and you're not upset about it like i said i think you're ending up in a much better position because of it. Next, you have the King of Clubs. This is a great card to have. It represents using, you know, the King of Clubs is very intelligent, and it's using your mind to do a lot of things this week to be very successful. Um, you know, this puts you in a very strong position as well. Like, it's like a position of influence this week like you you have influence other over other people this week and in a positive way it's not like you're manipulating people or anything like that it's just like your your words are influential this week and you're gonna they're gonna carry power and they're gonna help you to success and all those other things that you want in your life this week this guy he's a very hard worker so you're gonna have all that you know the hard working energy and again this is not a person this is just an energy that is surrounding you this week that's going to be building you up and this person is good you know at coming up with ideas and things like that anything that has to do with the mind they're very mental very good at using their brain for problem solving and all these other things so i feel like that's how you're going to be showing up this week like i said i think with this you really can't beat it very financially stable week use your mind to make that money and don't worry about whatever this is. I don't even think you are worried. I think you're happy to see whatever it is go. So thank you for watching your reading this week and uh, enjoy it.